Right now, a crisp, dry day for a change, yet one county is still dealing with street flooding. Look at this. Our Rebecca Schramm shows us the impact the recent rains have had here in northwest of Atlanta in Polk County. This is Cedar Creek, which runs right through Cedar Town in Polk County. On the map, it's called Dry Creek, but right now you can see it's anything but dry. Recent heavy rainfall has not been kind to parts of Polk County. Ditches and streams so swollen, water is spilling into some streets. In downtown Cedar Town, Everyone's glad it's finally drying out, especially today, Valentine's Day, the busiest day of the year at Bussey's Florist. Today is a gorgeous day. Um, woke up to sunshine, uh, clear skies, so it's great. Owner Todd Bussey is hoping a few days without rain will help the water recede, especially in some rural parts of the county. A couple of our employees have had to take different routes to work because of some flooding over the roads that they travel. I live on high ground, so I don't have any problem. Glenn Colvin says he's glad to know Polk County Schools delayed the start of the school day for a couple of hours today to give bus drivers some daylight as they maneuvered through the waterlogged streets. It's a good idea on the safe side for the kids. For now, they'll enjoy a dry day knowing another round of rain is coming next week. In Cedartown in Polk County, Rebecca Schramm, CBS 46 News. Thanks, Rebecca. We now know 